Millicent Follicle, Chapter 1 Your dreams will be as smashed as me. And in she comes, into the smoky bar, past the tables, and there's her friend sitting on the sofa. Oh! You're smashed! <laughs> Perhaps so, madam, but some day... Your dreams shall be as smashed as me, and all to dust upon the sands, to powder crushed your hopes and plans, beneath the weight of pointless fate. Before I die, you yet shall see, your dreams will be as smashed as me. Ha 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 ha! Fwump! <laughs> Bloody hell! Two Tuesdays previously, Scarabella and Cocodrino. Crack, crack, crackle, crack. Scrunch, scrunch, scrunch. Mm. <gasps> Scarabella! Cocodrino! Oh, how they beat me! Bastards! How many this time? Five, at least five. Bastards! And those magic bells the gods gave you to ward off all harm? It didn't bloody work. Ching, bing. Poor girl, poor girl. And the last bus long missed. Have you no blanket? How cold these bruises. I, only my handkerchief. Lay it upon my chest. Here comes the night, and here shall I freeze. <gasps> Wait for such extremities as this. Scrunch, 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 scrunch. More glad am I that bitten was in simple youth, scrunch, 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 by yonder radioactive vole. Dear friend, handy fellow, and here emburrowed, semi-snug, shall we beneath this crackling eiderdown together wait the frozen morning. <laughs> A license to resurrect the dead. And down we go into the walled city, and outside the town hall, a great throng of people. And we move into the queue, and there's the red-bearded doctor. Hmm? Russell, Russell, Russell. Ah, application for the renewal of a license to resurrect the dead, and a commercial group passport to the capital. Fifty krona. Title? Dr. Ludmilla Toby, Collegiate Resurrectionist, M.D. Hmm, you practice at the university? No, no, I maintain my own troop of recycled youngsters. But surely you are aware of the articles governing impractical frivolity? I, I run a strictly commercial enterprise to every form of function. My endorsements are impeccable. These certificates of public merit from the Department of Works. You see, we must reach Christiania in time for the Royal Variety performance. Huh. A sound business venture, hmm? You should be applying with one of the larger troops. Bah! The publicity will set me up for years. It was my researches that brought these girls back from the brink. And it shall be I who will reap the rewards. Enough! This smacks of the free enterprise of an individual. Your application will be processed in due time. Until then, you'll remain in the provinces. Denied. Thwack. Hmm. Huh. Damned fools, Bunk. I pay my taxes like everyone else. And off he goes into the city streets. Lizard chasers. Hee hee! A new breed of crocodile lizard. I shall catch it and name it after me. Pat, 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 pat. Hmm. Locked. Hmm. Hee hee hee. Zoop. Hmm. Whoop. Oh, it's you. Ha ha, yes. I haven't seen you for ages. Well, you know. Perhaps we're going to the same floor. Maybe, maybe. You look great. It's so nice to see you. You too. Whoop. That was my floor. I had important business. Hmm. Should we go back or keep getting longer? What do you reckon? Well, whoop, whoop, you. 
there they are. Millicent. A great comic, but life's not like that. My last five oor. Why didn't I get carrots? Gurgle. And laid off last Tuesday. Well, I can't go back. I shall have to live on barley. This terrible world. Yet, may there not be another baker's somewhere and another counter to attend? I'm not going back to the Gollum factory. Furious waggle. Rumble, rumble, rumble. For things are weary, yet not surely so bad. Yonder cloud seems more like a fish than a dragon. Yonder more like a pig than a minotaur. A strong argument for nature's fundamental benevolence. One more day, one more day. This weary world, on and on, relentless. I shall ask the tea leaves what the future holds. Blip, 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 blip. More of the same. Bloody hell! Roll up, roll up. Ah, risen troubadours, brides of science and entertainment. I, I shall view a moment before my labours resume. Mayhap these hybrid maidens shall distract me. And inside the tent... Loop Tisha. Bloop, 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 bloop. Ready, Loop. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. There they are again. Those dancing princesses. I could watch them all day. Loop, we're ready. A quick bottle to steady my hand, damn you. You can't rely on nobody. Last month it would have been a glass. <gasps> Hoist me up. And she puts on her smile for the crowd. <sighs> clink, 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 clink. A predictive tumble. And now for our last trick. A predictive tumble. High above your heads she hangs. And chained all about. Clink, clink. The pitiless cobbles neath. And into this ill-watered bucket. The names of all on little paper scraps. Scrap, 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 scrap. Who has a question? You, sir, the chemist. Um, well, who stole my cow? Very well. Are you ready, madam? Aye. Mistress Saboteur, proceed. Aye again. Clop. Clack. Whish. Wriggle, wriggle, clink, clink. <gasps> Splash. Your neighbour, the milkman. <gasps> the one with the new cow. To the dairy. A quick cut for the cup. Well, how do we do? Thirty all in. Not bad. Hmm. What about Scarabella and Cocodrino? They must have missed their last bus. They'll have to take their chances. We'll do better than beef and beer tonight. Ten for the boss, then off to the cognac den. Hurrah! Not so fast, girls. A quick cut for the cop. And as for you, saboteur, keep that clog afoot where it belongs. Oof. We don't like unnatural entertainments in this village, so here's five off for tumbling without a licence. And five off again for hubris. Damn. It's beef and beer for you, goggles. Wink. <laughs> Damn the Norwegian village constabulary. Forget it, Loop. Let's go. Twice bitten, thrice shy. Nothing ever changes and you can't rely on nobody. Bah, let's go. Hup, hup, hup. And away they go, jumping over the rooftops. Spotted cow. What a bunch. And I don't feel any better. I was right the first time. Everything's lousy and now I'm too tired to ask for work. Tremble. But perhaps there's some leftovers in the marketplace. Since no one's about, I shall sing a song to try and cheer myself up. Um, um, um. One morning in the month of May, as from my cot I stray, just at the dawning of the day, I met with a charming maid. Just at the dawning of the day, I met with a charming maid. Good morning to you, with her said I, good morning to you now. The maid replied, kind sir, she cried, I've lost my spotted cow. 
The maid replied, kind sir, she cried, I've lost my spotted cow. No longer weep, no longer mourn, your cow's not lost, my dear. I saw her down in yonder grove, come love and I'll show you where. I saw her down in yonder grove, come love and I'll show you where. And in the grove they spent the day, they thought it passed too soon. At night they homeward bent their way, while brightly shone the moon. At night they homeward bent their way, while brightly shone the moon. If she should cross the flowery dale, or go to view the plough, she comes and calls you gentle swain, I've lost my spotted cow. She comes and calls you gentle swain, I've lost my spotted cow. The Accident Ha ha, that's a bit better. I... Oh, a whole apple. I... Do I dare? I... Clang, clang, clang. Fire, fire in the dairy, make way. Clang, clang, clatter, clang, clang. Oh, I... Make way, make way. Oh, an Omega! And the horseshoe is the last thing she ever sees. Walk, 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 walk. Crack, walk, 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 walk. Thud. Clang, 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 thud. Make way, make way. Clang, clang, clop, 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 clop. And there she is, lying on the ground. And very slowly, up comes the red-bearded doctor. He looks down at her, looks up and down the street to see if anyone else is coming, reaches into his coat and pulls out a long white sheet. He wraps her up, puts her over his shoulder and takes her off down a side alley. And what do you think's passing through her head at this point? Let's have a look. A dark thing. Father promised me a small china doll with a blue silk frock, and I a new viola. Where can he be? Tis past midnight. Crash. Father, father. Aye, children. Smash. Fwump. Oh, what is it? A dark thing I found half-starved on the streets of Mansfield. Our beautiful things smashed. Aye, she fought like a tartar, but I brought her back. She's filthy. Loop, loop. What a noise. Nip. Ow. Tis all she says. We shall call her Loop Tisha. Loop. And we fade from this scene to a scene of the grown up Loop Tisha. The operation. Crash. As the doctor comes in through the door, there they all sit, smoking. Loop Tisha, you'll assist me. Prep up the cooling board. Another onion for the soup, eh, boss? <sighs> aye, aye, sir. Off they go together. Some day she'll go too far, that one. Aye, but when I'm made troop captain, ye shall be first mate. And in the room, they lay Millicent on the pink marble slab. Subject is 12 years old. Severe cranial contusions. Clack. Apparently from stampeding horseshoes. The youth of an ouse. Heartbeat and brain activity ceased eight minutes ago, but I am fairly confident that the soul has not yet left the body. She won't survive the procedure, of course, but you never know. Clip, 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 clip. Clip, 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 clip. The first thing is to relieve pressure on the brain. Platter loop, crackle. Scritch, splish. Humph. And through to the pericranium. Dab, dab. Crick. And there's the frontal lobe. Somehow the damage is all in the occipital. Turn her head. Christ. Cutting into the optic chiasma. What a fellow. There's nobody else would dare. Nobody. Thirty seconds before the nerves calcify. I've removed a few pointless convolutions and added one or two of my own. A shot of elixir to the pituitary gland and... Done. That's it. Suture her up, quickly. Shh, dink, shh, dink. A 
dose of adrenaline to the heart. Bzzzt. Lokes, ain't she green? It's a good sign. I've enclosed the spirit and repaired the brain. The body will just have to adapt to its new circumstances. Splap. Clean her up and get some sleep. The next six hours will tell if she lives. Lives. You're exhausted, Loop. Have an extra stimulant capsule. Aye. Munch, munch, munch. And we iris out on these two friends looking at each other. And that is the end of chapter one. <laughs>